I get a little melancholy realizing that Labor Day is just around the corner because, of course, you know, that means the end of summer. And if you were a kid, which I still am, it meant back to school. But if you're looking to squeeze in one last trip, well, you still have time to take advantage of some good deals. And joining me now is travel expert Mark Murphy. Good morning to you, Mark. Good morning, Martin. Okay, so apps. They can be yeah. a traveler's best friend, you say? Hotel app? Uh, give me one. Hotel tonight. If you want to get away just one last time, you know, you heard that music playing, you're all excited, you want to get away, how about get away for one night? And Hotel Tonight gets a uh, hotel inventory loaded at the last minute after 12 noon that day and in cities all over the country, and you can find a really cheap deal, sometimes as much as 70% off the normal published rate. So it's a way for the hotels to dump inventory at the last minute, but not put it out on the broad based internet. I like so that. So that's definitely a good one. Yeah. yeah. Gas Buddy, we're always looking to try to find the cheapest price. Sure, Gas Buddy is a great little app. You basically download it, you hit Gas Buddy, it geolocates you, and then gives you great gas deals all around. And that's basically put in by your fellow Gas Buddy uh, app users. So it's people seeing it, updating it, you see when it was updated, and then you can drive to the best. Uh, gas station for the best price for your fill up before you head to that great hotel you're going to stay at that night. Okay, now um, this next one is it? Is it Waz or it's, uh, how do yeah, I say it? It's, it's called Waze. Of course, uh, it's I it's a wrong. really neat. It, yeah, it's a crowdsourced GPS app. So basically, Wazers are driving all over the place, and the GPS tracks the uh, tracks the pace of the cars ahead of you because of your fellow Wazers. And because of that, it reroutes you around bad traffic. Because let's face it, if we're getting away, we want to get away. We don't want to spend time in the car. So less gas use, less time sitting around idling, more time at the hotel and the destination. So I like all of these apps. I think they're great, but I've got a human app for you. It's called a travel agent. And that human app, you does, it doesn't need a smartphone or anything else. You send them an email and sometimes they find you some great deals. Yeah, I was just thinking of the ways there. Um, you basically are benefiting from the suffering of those who are stuck. Is that the way it works? <laughs> Yeah, sometimes, sometimes, and especially, and they'll even tell you if there's a policeman ahead, so you avoid that little extra ticket that could add to your travel costs, oh, too. I, I so. like that. Okay, very good. Um, and anything that uh, last-minute travelers might want to avoid? Well, I would avoid traveling on that Friday before Labor Day and coming back that Monday. And if you can push it a little bit later, leave on a Saturday or a Sunday and extend it into the week of Labor Day week, that's going to be great. And then even look out you know, into shoulder season, which is September, October, November, and you'll find some of the greatest deals out there of the entire year because kids are back to school and it's a great time to travel and the weather's still fabulous. So get away to the beach, get away to some international destinations, great savings. All right, Mark Murphy with a lot of great apps and good ideas for a getaway for the upcoming holiday weekend. Thanks very much. Good to see you. You too, Martin. Travel safe. Still to come, good deeds get extreme.